Hey everybody, it's Deki no Sai here with another episode of Kirby's Epic Yarn. In the last episode, we completed a lot of sub-quests. sub, -quests, sub -quests, that's a Majora's Mask term I'm using there. And today, we're actually going to go to Cloudy Park. I realized some people were disappointed with that, and I just want to, you know, give it to ya. So, Cloudy Park. It's obviously reminiscent very much so for Bubbly Clouds. Um, one of the main things that are reminiscent of this level is the music in this level. I really, really, really have a big appreciation for the music in this level. It's, it's a rip, it's a repeating track in the Kirby series. It's one of those tracks that just doesn't go away. And this game is no exception. Right here we have bubbly clouds, spring clouds, whatever you want to call them. They will help launch you into the air. If you smash on them, you'll be able to go to higher, greater heights, rather. I shouldn't say higher heights, because that's kind of redundant. We also have a cloud rug. Lie down on this fluffy rug to feel like you're on cloud nine. Again, I need to do stuff with the house that I'm making, but one step at a time. One step at a time. Okay, I'm done with weird song references. You know, work, work tends to get a lot of songs stuck in my head. It's kind of annoying, actually, but what the hell? Kirby! Kirby! Chill, man! Stop this crazy thing! Okay. Okay, so we got the crystal star here. Hopefully that means we're very close to a bronze medal, bro, because I need a bronze medal, bro. <laughs> if we come up here, we have this exclamation mark, the pitfall- Oh my god, I almost died there. Well, maybe not died, but I almost fell into an endless abyss and I double- I double smashed? What? That's new. Anyways, hop up here, you'll be able to get these beads, and it's relatively simple. Unless you do this! Okay, I saved myself. I saved my ass. Not something you hear myself say every day. Not something you hear me say every- It's not something you hear me say all the- I screwed it. Oh my god, no! Let's try that again, this time with feeling. Now... As you may or may not know, if you haven't watched the episode where I went through the first level in Dreamland, uh, you may not know, but instead of, um, instead of giving up on the no-hit run altogether, I decided that I'm going to go by a three lives condition. That means, basically, if I get hit enough to where I lose my beads, I will reset the level, and this will happen three times consecutively. If I fail the third time, I'm just gonna continue through the level. Likewise, if I- OH MY GOD, FREAKING CRACKO! <sighs> Sorry, that man scares the bejesus out of me. <laughs> bejesus. Oh god. Okay, let's- let's do a little bit of backtracking, because I can't handle Krakow's crack. I mean, Krakow is on crack right now. Look at this- Look at this! Look at this freaking guy! Just tearing it up! Tearing it up! Oh my god, really? Dude, calm down! Oh my god, dude. Okay. We basically have to go all the way through the level again, just to avoid Krakow being on crack. Oh my god, really? Well, we're gonna miss a small little patch, but that's okay. I don't really care to stay in the level with Krakow anymore like this. But, as it turns out, I'm going to probably have to keep doing that. I'm not really sure what the rest of the level has in store for me, because I honestly, um... You know, this is relatively blind. I'm kind of playing this fresh since I've originally played it, so I'm not really sure and Shirtin? <laughs> I'm Shirtin, bro! Got me some shirts! Bubbly soda! This bubbly soda looks like it's filled with flavors. Try displaying it on a table. An epic table with bacon! Okay, I'm done with that. So, once you come over here, we'll find... More button flies, and I'm gonna go ahead and avoid that patch because... Actually, I think I need the patches because... Little do I know, the state of the affairs... Things aren't really looking up for me right now, and there's a freaking patch I can get with stars. Why not, right? I need my way to silver stars, or the silver medal, and... It, like, if I get the silver medal, at least, I'll be able to get the five-star bonus and end up with a gold medal. Because I really don't want to leave the level without getting a gold medal, because then I'll have to play through the level AGAIN! BEES! Fah! Oh my god. Okay, I need to get rid of this bee. I need to get rid of this bee. This bee is like... <sighs> Dick move right now. Oh, he's gonna stay up there, is he? I guess this is one of the many challenges in this level- NO! Ugh! That's number two. That's number two. 
All right, we're gonna see what's in this patch quickly. More beads, more beads. I could not agree with that anymore, so let's just keep going here. Also along this conveyor belt of button flies, there is actually another star piece up here. If you grab this up here, you'll have a better chance of actually getting a gold medal at the end, considering if you get a silver medal at the end, like I said before, you'll have to start all the way over. So now we're at this part with the freaking butt. Okay, so we are definitely on our third life now. We have to do something about that freaking fly that keeps carrying us a new one. I mean, carrying us a new one? I mean, seriously, I'm getting my ass kicked by a freaking fly here. A freaking fly, man. Can you imagine that? A freaking fly. Bump ourselves a little bit extra height, please. Thank you. A little bit extra height never killed us. Okay, we're still good. We're still good. We're still good. Okay, okay. These freaking clouds, man! These freaking clouds! <laughs> oh my god! Ugh, if I could just get up there. Thank you, okay. So now that we're up here... <laughs> my god, these clouds are tearing me a new castle. Looks like we're getting a new, new ability here. I'm interested in seeing what this has to offer. <gasps> oh my god! Anybody who has played Kirby Superstar will empathize with me that this is awesome! God. I'm definitely gonna get a gold medal here. Definitely. Definitely. With all the beads that I'm gonna get from this this path here. Yep. <laughs> then we have Krakos that are lining up to just take shots at us. And Sniper Ds that are lining up to get our streak down. I'm, I'm trying not to get hit in this one. Like seriously, screw the flies, screw the rules, I have money, I'm Dekinosa, thanks for watching, I'm a duck. <laughs> uh, Bronto Burtz, you ain't got nothing on me, you ain't got nothing. See, look at that, gold medal, and you just sitting here with a freaking bead in your hands, come on now, Shotso. Come on now, Shotso. You can't mess with this, you can't mess with Dekinosa. You freaking spear bees, spear Ds, spear bees. Can you imagine a, a, a freaking bee wielding a spear? Oh god, we need to get through this. We need to get- Come on, damn it! Oh my god, that would've- I don't even care about those extra- Oh yeah, I really don't care about those extra beads at this point. Bubbly Clouds! This classic tune was also in Kirby's Dreamland. This is actually- This entire world was a throwback to Kirby's Dreamland. I always thought it was like multiple Kirby games that we're getting throwback to, but no, it's just- it's just Dreamland. So we're facing off with Krakow once again. This time it's a side-scrolling shooter instead of the vertical shooter, like the rocket. Which is interesting, it's more like, um... Not very sure what it's more like, but... You know, it's more like something. It's like the side-scroll version of Toho, but... Yeah. I think it's some, like, classic arcade games that do this, like... Galaga? I don't think Galaga does this, I think it's top shooter. Whoa! Top-down shooter. <sighs> You're scaring me here, Cracko! Just lay off the crack, bro. My god, that's such an obvious joke. Like, I, I feel like it's too- I, I feel like it's almost corny because- Oh my god, he's doing like a Masenko Ha there. Like, oh my gosh. There we go. I broke him. We're done. We got this. With 255 streak. Oh yeah. Look at that. Look at my tail just like puff there. Oh my god. So fluffy. We didn't get the five star bonus piece. Oh well, I'll settle for three stars. Three star ball! So in Cloud Palace, we managed to get everything. We got 3,277 beats from that 255 streak, and all of the treasures. I'm very proud of this, actually. Boxing glove patch. Oh no. Oh, there's something we gotta do there too. But first, let's see. What does this pouch open to us? Looks like a muscle castle or something. Oh my. Castle DDD. What a classic. Alright, so we have unlocked Castle. Castle. Not Castle. Castle DDD. But first, we're gonna go see what our friend Zeke wants. 
What up, Zeke? How you doing, girl? Chilling in my pad? Mm. I'm here to play, Kirby. You have any spare time to have some fun? I really dig this room, by the way. You really put your own touch on it. Oh, by the way, man, I almost forgot. Here's a little something for you. Don't worry, you're gonna love it. It's super cool and Zeke approved. Oh my. That's right, we unlocked the Zeke fabric. It's actually one of the um, several fabrics that we unlock through completing all of the minigames. So if you complete all of the minigames, of course, they'll come over to your house one day and be like, Hey, what's up, bro? What's up, Kirby bro? Wanna do some Monopoly? And then they'll just give you the fabric. But anyways, let's see what else we have to do. Actually, you know, I'm gonna stop while I'm ahead. So until next time, thank you so much for watching. We're gonna do Castle DDD in the next episode. Until then, take it easy and decky harder!